As a news reporter, each day involves being sent to new and diverse locations, some being completely unexpected. For Knoxville reporter and anchor Brittany Nada, being sent to unpredicted locations is something she's become accustomed to, starting by coming to swim for UT. I had every intention of going to the University of Michigan. My dad went to University of Michigan to play football there, so I've been a fan my whole life, and uh, I knew I was going to go there. However, when offered scholarships to Tennessee, her intended plans changed. I uh, sort of just sort of landed on the University of Tennessee and just, I mean, it was almost like picking a name out of a hat. I had no intention of being here long term. I just thought I would come here and, and swim and just go on my merry way. While on the team, Brittany achieved many victories. She set several school and conference records, won seven All-American titles, and held position of captain her senior year. Even as a swimmer, Brittany was already an award-winning anchor. I would always have the anchor position, which means I'd be the last leg of the relays because I was a freestyler. Sort of the irony of always being the anchor leg and then going into an anchor position in my career. So I've been a lifelong anchor. <laughs> <laughs> when her swim career came to an end, she set her focus to another form of anchoring and went back to school to obtain a master's degree in journalism and electronic media at UT, leading her to her first job in Hazard, Kentucky. Having to take those steps and having to spend about a year and a half in Hazard was just a necessary part of the course to come back and live in East Tennessee. This is home. I love it here and I, I want to be here. So although Tennessee was not her first choice, Brittany is now proud to call Rocky Top her home sweet home. But like any good fan, she remains true to her colors. So huge Tennessee fans, still cheer for Tennessee, but if, uh, if it ever came to the day where Michigan and Tennessee would be playing each other, I might be in blue. <laughs> for UT Today, this is Ray Sturm reporting.